Now, at the Impossible Symposium. What if scientific laws are not eternal truths, but rituals of our ever-shifting perception? Today, Isaac Newton, the master of universal gravitation, faces Marie Curie, the pioneer of the invisible atom. Will they discover bedrock reality, or only the limits of our rituals? Don't blink. The answer keeps slipping away. Madame Curie, would you say gravity is a law or a habit of how we see falling apples? A habit, perhaps, Monsieur Newton. But habits change. Even radioactivity was once unthinkable. Change, yes. But if everything is flux, how can there be any law but perpetual surprise? Surprise repeats. Isn't repetition the seed of ritual? We measure what recurs, then call it law. Yet apples fall whether or not we write equations. Is science merely description, never command? Or a spell, the world yielded to by persistent observation. But spells too have limits. So, are we priests of patterns, rather than discoverers of truth? Perhaps the truth is that ritual and reality spiral inseparably. To seek law is to perform. And every experiment, the universe's applause. Or silence, the greatest unknown law. Patterns or just performance? If you felt the spiral tighten, hit like and subscribe. But here's the twist. Is your worldview a ritual too? Let us know below.